he has a YouTube video of this technique. Yes. If you want to see how his torch works at home, which is, has a lot more force, mm -hmm. it kind of travels around the car a little bit. It's just got more jet coming out. It looks the same, but it's got more jet. It's a little bit cleaner. Less of the carbon. So it's just a bit messy, the carbon, that's all. And we lock the door so the EPA can't come in. <laughs> Is it the EPA here? EPA. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, we'll be moving the wheels outside. <laughs> no, that gas leak we want. No, that's true. <laughs> okay. You'll find as you flame it, it won't flame perfectly even. So it might get a little bit off center. So you just go in and just make sure it's spot on. You can see a little bit of movement in it while it's still warm. Just a little bit of tightening. And now that's good. <coughs> like I said with the dribbles, load your sponge up slightly. Keep your hand on the inside and let it feed onto your hand so it feeds onto the wall of the pot and not dripping all the way down. You only want it on the top. If it gets on the inside, <coughs> it's not a big deal because it's not flame. The outside it is. Run enough, just enough, to work with it. Water on your hands is important. You want to start to work with this. It's already thin enough. So I'll start to lay it over. Compressing it as I do to keep it tight. Can we see it right now? Yes, yeah, sure. If you lay it over and compress, you keep it tight as it compresses, the clay compresses in. If you don't hold it tight, all that bunching up of the clay as it narrows its diameter gets all messy and starts throwing it off. So you, you lock it, you control it. Push down with the thumb. Sorry, I work from the back here. I'll push down with the thumb like that. Take it in. And then take it over again. And just gradually work your way in. Remembering that if you want to get your hand back in there, don't close it off too far. Simple things. Evening, evening out the wall. Now I like the profile of this one, so I'm going to use that. I put my hand up here to have something to work against, and the rib goes in underneath it and push up. Kind of work the shoulder now. I don't run along it, I just push it up in sections. This is probably the trickiest part of the sphere. You try to take that stuff off. As that gathers, that will grab your pot. Mm -hmm. So you take it off as it builds up, otherwise you're in for trouble. 